I can't tell what's wrong or right Should I go without saying goodbye? All I know is I need to be Somewhere else to set me free I don't know what to do now Need to figure it out But I don't know how I hope the wind will carry me And take me away to where I should be So, in this new normal, this will be my first trip going uh, to some place other than Mingling area, Cebu. Uh, so, I was able to get this great deal for Body and Island Wellness Resort. It's normally like $600 a night, but I was able to get a deal for $91 a night. So, I'll be going over there and checking it out and bringing you guys with me new normal and uh, we'll be taking a bus there and see you guys soon normal is about traveling here in the Philippines is you need a mask and a face shield to travel um, sometimes they make you wear the face shield but not always so uh, right now I'm waiting for the bus or over going over to Badian on a, I got on the bus to Burili, but uh, I'll be going to Badian. And from England area to Badian, it's going to cost me 185 pesos. So, I should be there in about three hours. You know, it's nice, the seats are nice and separated. Now, mind you, this, this bus is air conditioning so uh, that's why it's it costs more money to take plus you got a little movie playing
guys, I'm here with Jupiter, one of the security guards for the resort. And he's telling me a little bit about uh, the resort. What were you saying? Uh, the was since was founded since 1980. 1980? Yeah. Okay. Uh, it is a Virgin Island before. Mm. And now, the island is so what we can get into the ground then. So, so they had 12 acres? They uh, have yeah, owned by the owned by the by the Hector. Hector. And then the rest the rest is uh, barangay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even barangay. Yeah, barangay Saragosa. Saragosa? Ah, okay. Okay. And it is the fast boat. Which one's coming for me? That one, uh, the, the white one. Ah, the white one. Yeah. Okay. Uh, not the fast one. <laughs> not the fast one. <laughs> ah, okay.
guys, so we just got here to the Badian Island Wellness Resort. And let me tell you, this is first class, man. I mean, we got the sitting area right here, the nice couch. And then right over here, we've got a beautiful bed. Huge. This is amazing. Yes, we have air too, but look at this. Just open this up. And step out here. You're out here. Have this beautiful view. Bathroom here. Nice little sink area. Toilet of the day. Shower here. Then a bathtub. Yes. This is amazing. It's beautiful, isn't it? And this beautiful scene. We're just soaking in the tub. Remember, this is normally like $600 lost in faith. it for $91. Now what's an island without a sea? It's a the evening. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's wonderful. Even though we're getting a little, we had a little sprinkle. Beautiful scenery here at this restaurant. Yeah, it's an open air restaurant, so you got the nice breeze, evening breeze. You got a view of the pool and uh, some flowers around, so it's really fresh. I like the feeling of this uh, this restaurant. It's really nice. So remember. If you want Mexican food here, you have to pre-order it. And now you know. Again, and first uh, let's have a word of prayer father thank you so much for this food for blessing it and helping us to be here in this beautiful day in Jesus name amen all right guys let's dig in and try it's lumpia mm.
Caribbean Island Wellness Resort and it's been a little bit rainy but I'm gonna stop now so I'm gonna take a chance to go to their coral garden go do a little snorkeling and hopefully I can uh, use this to put my phone in it to get some shots underwater as well bring you guys along apparently I can only stay there about 30 minutes that's the time limit and then we'll be back can you show me how can you love me without you completely alone we've got other a few other people over here and we've got the beach area I'm gonna take a swim see what I can see and try to bring you guys along with me let's go oh, I did see a school of fish out there but because of the wave and the choppiness of the water stirring up the Stirring up the um, bottom, you could hardly see anything. So now I'm just enjoying the beauty of this water here and waiting for my boat to go back to the resort. And I'm gonna have a nice lunch, enjoy the resort a little bit more, maybe go to the pool. We'll see. And. Get ready to go home. So when you come down here from the main road, you have to get a tricycle and you saw that. And general, I mean, he at first tried to get a hundred pesos from me. Um, in the town where I'm living, it's only 20, about 20 pesos. But anyways, I know this is a tourist area. so. I spent 50 pesos coming down to the port from the main road. So, and there's no real, um, no real landmark to show you if you're driving yourself. Well, but, you know, there are two signs there, kind of faded. So, you just have to follow um, your GPS or your Google Maps or however you're going to try to find it and then you make your way down and down to the port and of course you get the boat over here now if you're if you are getting a boat before or after their time from seven to five then you have to pay an extra 400 pesos but between seven and five um, it's free for the guests. So these are a few things to think about uh, as you come over here to the island. The paddle boats are free to use and, uh, and a couple of other activities are free to use. So the, the massages are 2,800 pesos per, for an hour. Um, unless they get you a discount. So, I spent one night here, and it was, so I got to spend uh, some of yesterday, so the evening here, and it had a beautiful sunset. Could have been better, but it was still nice. And then, uh, I spend the night here and even 
with the rain, it was still a beautiful day here. Nice and peaceful. I would recommend it. Now, I booked for a uh, family room, a uh, family uh, hotel room, and but when I got here, they, I guess they didn't see that, especially since it's only one, me, one person. So they uh, put me into a junior suite. Well, I didn't realize that until this morning. So what happened, I went down and spoke to them about it and they said, well, what we can do for you is uh, comp your lunch and also um, allow you to check out late. Well, I was hoping an extra night, but they, they didn't go for it. So anyways, so when you check in here, make sure uh, that it's the room that you you asked for. Uh, also, when at least on Agoda, um, you've got the price, and then they add the VAT to it. So remember that. Okay. So still, this is normally a five to six hundred dollar room, and. I, I was able to get it for $91. Like I said, it's a nice place. Um, average food, you know, your, your meal and your drink. If it's not alcohol, it's generally about, uh, about $16.